My name is Bruno Sade from brunosade.com. Recently on Reddit, which is a popular internet forum, I came across an unusual, possibly half-joking question about EFT. If I tap while someone is beating me up, can I walk away without hard feelings? So in today's video, I would like to share my response. It's actually a good question. The way that I see it, if you've had the unfortunate experience of being physically assaulted, it's completely natural to walk away with some hard feelings. When faced with such a threat, the nervous system typically shifts into survival mode, potentially triggering fight or flight responses. Alternatively, you might freeze, which is a response that seeks to numb pain and potentially reduce the likelihood of further aggression. Now, these are all instinctual survival reactions designed to protect you. However, after the situation is over, there's often a residual layer of survival stress stored in your body a leftover from the traumatic experience. In other words, a part of you might still be on high alert, not realizing that the danger has passed, and hopefully it has indeed. And you might find that that traumatic experience is still affecting you emotionally. So that's where EFT comes in. It can help you process and let go of the emotional charge attached to that memory, aiding your body and nervous system to let go of this stored survival stress. However, it's important to remember that when it comes to processing these traumatic events where our physical safety was compromised, it's advisable not to attempt it alone. Given the risk of re-traumatization, it's safer to work with a skilled practitioner. So that's it for today. I hope this was useful and I look forward to seeing you again in one of my next videos.